sometimes in life you gotta risk it for the biscuit. Let's go, baby. Now I've lost it. Oh my god, I knew it wasn't worth it. Yes guys, hope everybody is doing well. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video in the car, in the van, whatever you want to call it. We are continuing on for another day exploring the southeast coast of the UK, somewhere where I've never been before until yesterday. So in the previous video, I just drove from London and went to Sheppey Island and to Hearn Bay, which is where I stayed last night. And today I'm gonna to continue on that road trip, visiting Margate and the White Cliffs of Dover, and then I'll try and find somewhere to stay for tonight. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. I think I've just come across a snake. This is what a snake is in the UK. I think it's actually dead. Is that a snake? Should I touch it? Probably not. Definitely a snake. Oh, I think it's dead. I love animals, by the way. This is not animal cruelty or anything. I just think the snake has unfortunately been stood on. Oh my God. Oh. Yeah, it's dead. Oh, shit. is it dead? Oh, shit. it's not dead. Now. Buddy, watch out, it's not dead. Oh, get out the path or you're gonna get stood on. Oh. Okay, I'm leaving it. I almost stood on that, that was why I was trying to move it. I thought he was dead, maybe he's playing dead because birds might come after him. It's been a very slow start to the day. Just gone to Audi, which is so ridiculously cheap. I think this was 59p? which is crazy, I've never paid that little for some pasta. So, got dinner sorted, and guess what? I'm hungry again. I hate cooking, it takes so bloody long. Such a waste of time. After lunch, I promise we will do some exploring, and hopefully I'll be able to show you some epic drone shots of Margate, because it does look like quite a nice town, to be honest with you. Very traditional, very classical, but they've got a nice beach down the front, so we'll check it out after I've had some food. Just bought some meats and cheese selection, Gonna whack this in a wrap with some spinach and some garlic. Mayo. Two bits in there, my boy boy. Three bits in there, boy. You know what I mean, Lee? Bit of cheese. Screw it, two bits of cheese, why not? Life's too short. Bit of spinach. <gasps> 10 second rule. Some garlic aioli, the best sauce in the world. <laughs> Lunch on the go, love it. Have a couple of these, and then yeah, explore Margate. Hmm, that'll do. Wow, look at this street. These are some very classical English townhouses. Look at this house. Hey, I like that. Adventure awaits around every corner. It's a bit early for Christmas, no? Quite a few shops already getting prepped. This is like a William Shakespeare kind of town. Look, more Christmas lights. We're still a month and a half away, people. Come on, relax. Just strolling around Margate, walk down to the beach, and sunset is in about half an hour. such lovely little towns. Well, I did know that, but it's nice to come down.
Right, that was good fun walking around Margate. Couldn't do it for too long. Wow, the sky is on fire. Look at this. Oh. Woo! Oh, woo! How about that for a sunset? Right guys, I found somewhere to stay for the night. Once again, using the app Park for Night, there's a memorial right behind me and the ocean is right there. And what's quite funny is I am opposite France because Dover is where you get the ferry from Calais or Dover, sorry, to Calais in France. And even the radio station has now changed to French. Now, uh, my French is uh, not so good. A little, little, uh, un petit peu, hein? ça suffit en culé. Hein? Yeah, so don't understand the French radio, but that's all good. But I thought that was quite funny that even though I'm still in England, I'm still getting signal or however it works to France, so I can now listen to the French radio. Oh, Jesus very very windy out here just gonna put my back window cover on so nobody can look inside oh no 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 maybe this isn't the best spot I've got no phone signal phone signal has officially gone you know what I was just about to say this is what dreams are made of cooking food about to eat it i've got the germany versus spain game on my uh, on my phone was gonna watch that while i eat but i've just dropped half my pasta on the floor and uh there's no way i'm doing the 10 second rule with that i'm gonna eat up dinner guys which is tortellini spinach a bit of the chorizo which i had left over from lunch and then head off to bed quite early because i'm actually pretty tired and uh, yeah, then hopefully we'll wake up to an awesome sunrise and some awesome views of the coast. And I should be able to see France in the morning if the weather is clear. Catch you guys in the morning. Morning guys, and welcome to France. I wish, I bloody wish I was in France because then Europe is accessible. Anyway, I didn't actually end up staying where I parked last night on this cliff top because I just literally had no internet connection for like four or five hours and I wanted to speak to a few friends and a few people so I drove back into the town of uh, Deal I believe and I've just driven back up here this morning because of course I wanted to come and check out the view however the weather isn't as clear as I'd hoped because we cannot see France annoyingly France is over there in the distance uh, just out of arm's reach Please, God, after the lockdown, get me into France, get me into Europe. Anyway, I'm gonna head down to the beach because you've got St. Margaret's Bay just in front of me, down there somewhere. And yeah, we'll go for a stroll this morning and check it all out. Oh, wow. Some lovely, lovely views here of the countryside, that's for sure. I don't really wanna walk any further, otherwise, hasta la vista. Oh, oh. Don't ask me why I'm doing this, but I'm getting the drone up for you guys. God damn, I hope it's worth it because it is super windy, probably about 20 mile an hour winds at the minute. And the uh, my drone can handle about 17. Dear Lord, please make my drone come back to me. Oh my god, the winds actually just started the propellers even without me turning the drone on. I'm going to fly it here and see how it holds up. I know as soon as I get it up I'm going to be so tempted to fly it over the ledge. Oh, I don't know. Oh god. It's definitely struggling. Sometimes in life you've got to risk it for the biscuit. Let's go, baby.
Jesus! Holy sh! I've lost signal. Oh dear to God! The thing can't come back. Me, we're on a mad mission to go and get it. Hell, I've lost it. Oh my God! I knew it wasn't worth it. Oh! Oh! My God! Malik Mini. I love you. I thought that was it, gone. Full pelt, full power, on sport, in the wind. Wasn't budging at all. I had to walk down probably 300 meters from where I just was. Bon Apo Tito. Right guys, after having some breakfast and a bit of walk around on the, uh, on the cliff tops, I've decided that I'm gonna head back to London because it's just so windy and I feel like I'm ready. I need to go back, have a clean up, have a shower. Not smelling just yet. So that is my Southeast Coast two, three day road trip over with. Definitely a few more places that I could come and visit if I uh, drive towards Hastings and Folkestone, I think. Apparently they're quite nice areas. But uh, for now, I'm going to leave it there. And uh, yeah, I'll probably come back here in the future. It's been a really fun few days. Again, testing out the van, doing it solo. And so far, really, really enjoying it. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching the video. If you enjoy them, then please make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and give a comment what type of things you want to see me do next. As always, guys, stay safe, stay positive, and I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.